What's up? <clears throat> All right, so I thought I'd show you um, the gym I've been working out in for like a year, AKA my garage. So um, I mostly uh, find this stuff on OfferUp. Actually, that's only where I found my stuff. I just found out about Let Go. Um, or Let It Go, Let Go, I don't know. Um, but Offer Up was pretty awesome um, in finding all the stuff that I have. Um, first thing I have is the squat rack. So the person I found this from, they must have just posted it because, I mean, it's, it's just the uh, fitness gear thing you, get, you can get from Dick's Sporting Goods. Um, it's really nothing special, uh, but it has lasted. Nothing is broken on it. The uh, safety arms are not bending or anything. Um, you know, the little rubber stuff on here kind of peels, but that doesn't make a difference on anything. Um, but yeah, the person I got it from, they, uh, they were getting rid of it for 200 bucks. So it was that, they gave me that, um, the set of 45 pound plates, 35, 25s, 10s, two sets of fives and um, 2.5s. Uh, they had that bench and uh, oh, the, um, the weight tree, all that for 200 bucks. So I was like, uh, hell yeah, they were pretty far away, but it was worth it. I just got a trailer and went and got it. It was already uh, disassembled and um, yeah, had it ever since and it's been awesome. Um, I don't really see a need to upgrade, at least for now, just because there's nothing wrong with it. Why get rid of it if, if nothing's wrong with it? Um, and so the next thing, um, I had these really crappy, rusty um, barbells, no name brand, this one too. I, I got this barbell from the same people. Um, this one I already had. And oh, God, I keep forgetting. I also got this, the, uh, the preacher curl bar or easy curl bar, whatever you want to call it. Um, so all that was there too, I, I forgot about that. Um, so if you're looking to do a garage gym, offer up, man, do, or, or Craigslist or whatever. Um, so then I got, I finally upgraded my barbell. It's just a rogue Ohio power bar. This thing's awesome. Um, just the black zinc uh, coating. Um, or whatever, the silver sleeves. It's been pretty cool. Uh, I want a deadlift bar because I'm starting to do hook grip now with my deadlifts. And um, the deadlift bars are a little bit thinner. Um, I think that power bar is 30 or so millimeters. Uh, the deadlift bar I think is 27 or 28. So I'd be able to uh, grab the bar a little better. Um, little DIY projects. I did the... Uh, uh, the deadlift platform by myself, um, it's just horse stall mats and then two pieces of plywood. I mean, really, it's, that's all it was, man. I mean, nothing special. Uh, it's pretty crude. You know, my cuts weren't awesome, but it does the job. I've had that for a little over a year. Um, these Weeder Pro plates also offer up. That was from a different uh, person. Um, they were getting rid of like 750 pounds worth of those Weeder Pro plates. Um, and I had an other squat rack. I got rid of that one. It was one of those crappy standalone, whatever squat racks um, for like a hundred bucks. I mean, 700 pounds in weights for a hundred bucks. I, that was a steal. Um, some of the things I have, I have just, uh, I just got these and these are awesome. Uh, just the bands, you know, I do hamstring curls with them because with a power, or, you know, a garage, it's kind of difficult to, you know, you got to get creative with some stuff. Um, I have the dip belt, so I'll jerry-rig that thing to do some belt squats, uh, dips, power pull-ups, you know, all sorts of whatever. Um, my weight belt from bodybuilding.com, I've had that for like six or seven years. There's nothing wrong with it, so I get rid of it. Um, and then just some wraps and straps and whatnot. Uh, let's see, more DIYs, the boxes. I 
uh, built myself. Um, Home Depot did the cuts. I just gave them the measurements and all that stuff. They did the cuts and I came home and built them myself. Nothing special, but it is nice having two of them. Uh, I got the Titan Fitness Row thing. It's super big. I didn't know it was gonna be that big. I mean, and it's heavy as shit. Um, like, man, it's like 15 pounds maybe, um, which whatever. But it's cool, it works, it's nice, um, heavy duty. Uh, that was cool. I got the Titan Fitness um, uh, safety squat bar. It's, I like it. Um, I like safety squat bar squats, but I, I know I, I read the reviews before I even got it, but I was like, oh no, it'll be fine, I'm sure. This crap, these are way too spread apart uh, for a guy my size. If you're like under 200 pounds, those things are really spread apart, unless you have a really wide shoulder girdle, whatever. Um, those things, it's like almost on the, uh, on the tips of my shoulder blades. And um, I, it's really not horrible, but like I tried doing the, um, the front squats with those and it just was like sliding off and it was really uncomfortable. I read the reviews and some people just took it to a welder and they just brought these in like half an inch or an inch and they said it worked perfect. So I think I'll just do that. Um, it's a great bar. Otherwise, everyone's talking about the whip, but hey, I don't do enough weight for it to whip very much. So yeah, I'll be all right. Um, just those weird dumbbell, Olympic plate dumbbell um, things. Uh, and that's pretty much, oh, well, of course, you know, tractor tire and some dumbbells, Walmart, offer up. That was like 60 bucks on offer up. I bought the sledgehammer from, uh, Home Depot and I like to do sledgehammers and tire flips and stuff. People in my neighborhood think I'm crazy, but I don't care. I'm in some gated community in Ruskin, Florida, so I'm sure they've probably never seen that kind of stuff. But yeah, I just wanted to show you what I've been working with. It's nothing special, like I said, but people with garage gyms, I'm sure they understand, you know, when times is tough, it's hard to uh, want all this stuff and wanna buy it. When you look at your account, you're like, mm, probably should hold off. But I love it because you don't have to wait for squat rack to open, bench to open, deadlift platform to open, and then you get pups. You get pups to uh, keep you company. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Just wanted to show you that. And uh, if you have a garage gym, power, more power to you. Um, keep grinding. And uh, yeah, till next time. See you.